go play. Who is it? Who is it? We just ate. Well, I didn't know you were home early. I'm sorry. I have to. But if it doesn't start in the morning, I have. I got put on Valentine's Day weekend because all the women want that day off. Isn't that great? Oh, huh? That's January. I know. January 14th is not Valentine's Day. <laughs> That's embarrassing. <laughs> I mean, we can't go on Valentine's Day because I have conferences. Not because you're on call. Let's go play. Okay, it's not your fault. Play. Welcome back to my channel, you guys. Welcome to my night routine. This is gonna be the most real, raw night routine. I'm um, just gonna show you real life. Yeah, I don't even know I'm gonna talk to you that much. I just wanted to kind of capture what our nights have been looking like without being like fake or aesthetic or trying to like curate anything. I just wanted to just prop up my camera on a normal night. Show you what it's like to teach six-year-olds all day that suck the life out of you and then come home to a one-year-old. <laughs> so I was always curious what this would look like. Um, so this is what it looks like. It is a very normal Thursday. Michael just got home from work earlier than normal. So we already ate dinner and like, it kind of started our night routine and I was not expecting him to be home for another hour. So that's a nice surprise, but just wanted to start the video. Thank you for watching. If you are not subscribed, I would love for you to subscribe. And also, Merry Christmas Eve if you're watching this the day that it goes live. I'm uploading this on Saturday the um, 24th because I don't want to upload on Christmas morning because you need to be spending that time with your family instead of watching me on YouTube. So, Merry Christmas. I hope that you have the best weekend. Let's continue on our night routine. Let me turn it on. Let me turn it on. No freaking way.
while. It is now 7.35. Um, and I'm starting like my actual night routine now. 4.30 until about 7.30 is just kind of like unloading from the day, getting dinner for Jordan and Michael and I from the time dinner wraps up around 5.30 until like 6.30 ish, we just spend that whole hour like in the basement with her playing or in her room playing or something. And then around 6.30, you've kind of already seen all this, so I shouldn't re-explain it, but then we give her a bath, bottle, bed. But like that whole chunk of time is Jordan time because Michael and I as working parents miss so much of her day that when we get home, we obviously need to like put our lunches away and like make dinner and eat together. But then like we just want to sit and enjoy her and so that's what we do. We usually don't do any housework or run any errands or anything like that. Everything that we need to get done, whether it's Michael's school or me edit a video or like house stuff around the house, um, all of that pretty much happens after she goes to bed. It's now 7.35. This is when like my night routine starts. I just a couple little like tips before I get unready and don't really talk to you. I love my nighttime skincare routine and I love like this exact moment when I take a really long shower. Um, like tonight I have to wash my hair so it's going to take a really long time. Every night I really truly look forward to this part in my night. I think I just, I find a lot of my me time at night because I know that Jordan is asleep. I know she is good. I soaked up every minute I could with her and now it's my own time from now until I go to bed and I really soaked that in so like right now I'm gonna take a shower. I need to wash my hair tonight so it's like a full shower tonight. Um, I do my nighttime skincare routine and then right after my shower, um, just within the last month I have been incorporating like my quiet time right after my shower and it has been a game changer. I have talked about this before where I've really tried find like a time in my day for reading my Bible, prayer, just sitting and listening and being with the Lord. I definitely used to do that in the mornings, but I found lately that I'm just not really focused if I do it in the mornings. I see it more as something to check off my to-do list, but if I do it right after I shower and I'm like comfy, I have no worries like about the day that's ahead or the things I need to get done or I'm, and I'm not rushed. I actually can sit and just listen and be still and it's so nice and then we're just gonna chill yeah I definitely need to wash my hair so let's get unready mm -hmm. 